Sup guys, it's Lady Maylene here, and I am back from Anime Expo 2014. Well, I got back like a day ago. Um, I'm sorry if this video is kind of poopy because I'm having trouble with the lighting. So I had to bring in a bunch of lamps in here and it's hot now. And also, I wanted to be in this video and cosplay and stuff, but obviously that was the convention was like two days ago. So I'm not going to be in this video and I look really poopy and I just woke up. So I'm actually trying to um, be in most of my videos, but next video, next video, I promise I'll try that. Oh look, shadows! Okay, so I have a lot to say about the convention. Um, too much. If I said everything, then this video would be like two hours long, so I'm not gonna do that. It's gonna be boring. So, um, I'm just gonna say, uh, oh, I also, um, I'm gonna make a vlog about it. Um, I recorded some things in the convention, so that video will be up after this video. Also, by the end of the video, I'm gonna announce the contest winner, so don't forget to watch that. Alright, so the convention was very unorganized, like, very, everybody kept complaining about it. It was hot. I mean, like, it was so bad, I could not stay in cosplay because I kept sweating and sweating and sweating, and, like, my makeup that I took so long to do was melting off, and I was really mad about that. I don't know why it was so hot in there. Um, but I really did not like that. So and also the line for um, getting your badge was five hours long and that was horrible. I was almost just gonna run run away crying because I couldn't stand it anymore. And um, it was so hot and I was sweating. I was like literally dripping sweat. It was gross and horrible and yeah, there was just too many people. And I don't know why they don't mail the badges. And, um, it was just so hot and my feet were burning, like, I f they were going numb because they hurt so, ma so much. And till now, my feet hurt super bad and at the convention, I couldn't walk or stand for more than, like, an hour without sitting for, like, another hour because they hurt so much and they were, they're, like, bright red and they hurt so bad. And that, I really like the convention. I, th I had a lot of fun and the dealer's room was amazing and also too big and too many people <laughs> because I could not see everything. I kept missing things and then I passed some things and I was like, oh, I'm gonna come back for that. And then I have no idea where that booth was again and I never found it. So, that was kind of bad. But anyways, um, sorry for talking too much. I'm gonna show you what I got now. And so this haul, I took $500 to the convention. And I mean, personally, I don't think this is so much for $500. I'm like, this is all I bought. I took so much money. But I guess everything I got was kind of expensive, so it makes sense. But I still love everything I got. Okay, so I'm gonna show you Artist Alley stuff first. So here we have this Uno print that got bent. Which is not cool. And this is what it look like. It is beautiful, absolutely beautiful. I love this picture. I was like, ah, I need this, I need this, I need this. I think it was $10. The next print I got is one of the most beautiful prints I've ever seen in my entire life. And it also got bent. <laughs> and it's this Elsa and Anna print. Um, I didn't get the name of the artist, but... This is so pretty. I seriously just saw this and I was like, I need this, I need this, I need this. I don't care how much it is, I need this. <laughs> I also saw another Elsa print I wanted super badly. And I remember where it was and then I went to look for it and I, I couldn't find the booth anymore. I was like, no, where, where did it go? And these next few prints are so cute that it made me scream. Uh, this person was selling a bunch of different Pokemon that are really, really cute, like this one. Um, so Persian is my favorite Pokemon, and I never, ever, ever, ever find anything Persian. So if I find something Persian, I'm like, ah! So this is what happened <laughs> when I saw this. I was like, oh my god, I need this, I need this, I need this. So I got, there was three for 20, so I got three. I got Persian, though, of course, I was gonna get this. I got Meowth, which is one of the cutest things Ever, I Meowth is one of my favorite Pokemon ever, but I really hate Team Rocket's Meowth, so that's just not good. <laughs> but I like every other Meowth, it's so cute. Uh, the last one I got is Sylveon, and it's uh, absolutely adorable too. Next, from the same person, I got two sp uh, sticker sheets. So this is the Animal Crossing sticker sheet, which is so cute. I think I'm gonna put some of these stickers on my DS. Oh, I'm so excited. And then the Evolution one, which is crazy cute too. Oh my god, look how cute! Ah! Sorry. <laughs> 
Then I got these two sticker sheets. This is a Sylveon sticker sheet. Being so cute. So, so cute. Oh, there's even a shiny one. Cute. And a Gengar one. And it has Haunter and Ghastly too. Look, they look so cute. <laughs> this is so cute. I love these. I also got this Charlotte sticker, which is really cute, and I really, really like Charlotte. I don't really like her eyes, but everything is really cute, so I like it. Um, I also wanted to show you guys the free stuff I got, so this is the free stuff. Sorry, I guess there's gonna be a glare. <laughs> so, I guess apparently I missed out on a ton of free stuff because I keep seeing videos and they're like, Oh, I got this Sailor Moon coin and this free Sailor Moon poster and these free cards and free stickers. I was like, I didn't see any of these things. But I did get this free manga book of Buddy Fight Starter book, I don't know. And they gave out a free Natsu card. I don't know if this is, like, supposed to be together? Is it? Yeah, I guess so. So it's that, this card game, I guess. This uh, Sailor Moon Crystal card. And apparently they were giving a poster for free. And I was like, no, oh, I want it. It's so pretty. Like, I need to put this on my wall as soon as possible. It's really cute. Then this Sailor Moon one, which is just the original. This random book with things and stuff in it. Yep. <laughs> Tissues from J-List, just like every year. You get free uh, Nature Bar, Nature Valley, whatever. And Sailor Moon glasses. <laughs> Someone you want to be is Sailor Moon. So these are the pins I got. Um, I got all Sailor Moon pins because I wanted to put it on my jacket for when I was Punk Sailor Saturn. But nobody really recognized me anyways because my staff wasn't there. So this, these are the ones I bought. It's Jupiter and this artist. I seriously wanted to buy all their pins. And I, after I bought this, I never found their booth again. I, I just, I don't know where it was. <laughs> Uh, Sailor Moon one where she's eating, Sailor Saturn, because I needed Sailor Saturn ones, and this is the only one I found. And Venus, who looks really cute. But I really wanted other pins. There was somebody selling you Maniki pins. If that's you, where were you? <laughs> because I saw them once, and then I was like, I'm coming back! I didn't find them again, and I looked for them for like an hour. So yeah, but these are the pins I got. Stop being glary! Stop it! Yay, it's stop! Um, from the, de I mean, dealers from Artist Alley, I also got this for Lolita, so that, it's just this. It's really cute, and it has, like, cream in it, like, their sandwiches, and this is what it looks like, and it's really cute, and I can't wait to wear it. Yay, I think it was $16. It was not cheap, but I really wanted this. <laughs> All right, now, dealer's room stuff. So, this is pretty much the first thing I got. It's an Elsa backpack. I actually was gonna use it at the con and <laughs> I keep forgetting, so I didn't, I didn't use it. It was $15 and I'm kind of mad because I found it online for 10 <laughs> But it's okay, it's okay. Come down, come down. <laughs> and the same booth, I bought this Elsa and Anna and Big Nose. <laughs> That's what my mom calls them. She's like, hey, look, it's Big Nose. Um, for like pencils or whatever. I'm gonna use it for makeup because I like my pencil case. <laughs> and this is my Melody one, which, I mean, I was looking for anything my Melody since I love my Melody so much. So I found this and I was like, yes, 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 what, 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 what. So it's really cute. I'm also probably going to use it for something makeup-ish or something like that. It was only, what, $4? This was $5, which I think was pretty cheap for, like, convention and especially Frozen because everything's, like, a million dollars right now. So there's some of this. I'm sorry, the light is so horrible. <laughs> um, so <laughs> I got this Cadence plushie, and I kind of freaked out when I saw it because if you don't, guys didn't know, Cadence is my favorite pony and one of my favorite not anime characters ever. And she got squished in my bag, so her horn keeps going down. And I was like, oh my god, this exists! I didn't know this was even like I've never seen this because I have almost everything Cadence. And I saw it, well, the tag's in Japanese, so I'm guessing this is only in Japan. I almost forgot to show you one of my favorite purchases. <laughs> Ta-da! I know, I know. She's in a bikini. I couldn't find her with clothes on. <laughs> but I found this Super Sonic Go pillow, and I was like, I want it! And it was $35, and that is really cheap for a body pillow, because I've seen body pillows go for, like, 100 and it's super sonic and I love her and oh my god, it's so cute. I really 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 like this Okay, so the light's gonna be really bad right here because this is a lamp I'm using <coughs> for my light and it was on here So I also got the super sonico gloomy bear figure and I am totally determined to cosplay this I love 
This looks so much. I think she is so cute. So, 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 so cute. Sorry the light is making her look kind of weird. I don't know what's going on with this light. But, um, alright, so this is Sakura Kinomoto from Cardcaptor Sakura. And when I saw this, I kind of freaked out because this is one of my all-time favorite series and I never find anything of it. And I thought this was one of the most beautiful things I've ever seen in my whole life. And I was so happy. I literally was like... I don't care how much this is, I'm buying this right now. And I ended up buying it for 35 so I was like, yes, this is so cheap. And then I saw it in other booths for like 50 and 60 I was like, oh my god, I got it for really nice. But I'm really mad because my mom accident. well, yeah, it was an accident, I don't blame her. She didn't know, it had a base, so she threw away the base and now she has no way to stand. So if any of you guys have any idea how I can stand her because she stands on her leg like this and I want to cry because oh my god like she's so pretty look her dress is absolutely gorgeous like wow this is pretty in one of my all time favorite series so that's so cool and now she doesn't have a base and it's sad because maybe if she was standing I could somehow stand her but she's not standing she's just on her tippy toe and it's supposed to go like she's flying and I don't know what to do. I'm gonna try to make a base for her, but if anybody has any ideas that would help me so much. <clears throat> I'm sorry the light is really bad. It's like so shiny. It's making everything look weird. But anyways, I'm really excited about this one. It's a Venus and it's her, it's her little itty bitty figure. <laughs> I really wanted to get a bunch of these, but <clears throat> they were really expensive. So. <laughs> anyways, I got this. And I actually had no idea what this was because it was on Japanese. I was like, what is this? And I had like all the... Sailor Scouts, so I was like, why not? Let's just buy this. And it was pretty cheap, four dollars. And it's really pretty. And then when you open it, it's like a little case, and it's like a mirror. Look, I can't kind of see me. Look, you can see the camera. And like this. And I thought this was super perfect to carry uh, pills for like stomach ache or headaches or something. I put it in my bag because I used to ha carry them in a little bag, and then they always fell off, fell out, and got everywhere. So this. You can just put them in here and be like, oh, my stomach hurts. And I'll be like, oh, it's okay, I got some pills in here. Yeah, so anyway. <laughs> and here's this cute window kitty that is fluffy and you can hang him on things. And I'm seriously almost done showing you what I bought. And this seriously does not seem like $500. <laughs> and I also bought um, presents for my friends. It wasn't that much, so I don't know. Um, but I'm not going to show you guys that because those, those are presents. So this one's really cute. Alright, so I'm, not, I'm now going to go with some mini figures because I kind of bought a lot. So I got these two Sakura ones. And they're both so cute. Oh my god, I seriously love this series so much. And it's really rare for me to find something. So when I find something, I get so happy. I used to be obsessed with it. Oh, and and uh, there was none, no more of these. But I bought another one of these for my next uh, giveaway. So that's going to be part of the next giveaway. They're so cute. These are the next ones. And I'm going to show them all at once. They're all minifigures. And they're really, really, really cute. I love every single one of them. Um... Yeah, <laughs> they're just really cute. Here's what they look like. I didn't want to make this video too long. It's probably already really long, so yeah. Oops, I forgot I had this. I got this Scorumbo Tenma um, keychain, which is really cute. I've never seen. I don't ever see anything Scorumbo, and I really like that show. So I was like, yes, I take this. And this next thing is what I spend pretty much all of my money on, and that is boo Creepsville stuff. <laughs> <clears throat> so they were there and I was like, yes, yes, want, 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 want. So here are the eyeball hair bow, eyeball hair bows, is that right? <laughs> that I got and now that I'm seeing, I think maybe I got too many, I don't know. So, uh, this one is black with green on it. There's a pink one, a red one. I really like the red one and there's only one red one. <clears throat> and two black ones. And these are the other accessories I got. I got these bones that are bloody. Yeah. And whatever this is, it's, I guess it's the flower of the skull. There, I think these were five dollars. That's why I got these. I thought they were cute. Um, this was free, so thank you so much for that lady who gave me free this pin thingy. So that's really really nice. And the other hair accessories are these. Um, which I call it. Okay, I'm back. I'm really stupid. And I was like, wait, what are these called? What are they called? What are they called? Bobby pins. Oh my god. <laughs> They have them on the back. <laughs> and just this dead girl. I thought they were cute. 
<laughs> that took me so long to remember. I feel stupid. And I also got this necklace, which I was debating on since I got there because it's $25. And, but I told myself if I didn't find anything else I could buy, and then I'm just going to get it. Like, whatever. I love this, so I just ended up buying it anyways. And yeah, this was $25, so it could have been like another figure. <laughs> but no, I'm really, really happy about this. This is cute. And guess what this is? It's something I totally don't need at all, like whatsoever, but I bought it anyways. So it's another coffin bag. <laughs> and this one is the vamp one, which has like the bats and yeah, here's the chain. And I already have two of the same bag except different designs. But I kind of went crazy because they were selling them for $40. And I bought mine for one of them for $50 almost $60 and the other one almost $70 so it's like oh my god I've been buying them so expensive and these are just 40 so this is what this looks like I also got this dress from them which was 35 and it's a skeleton dress and I've wanted this for I don't even know how long I saw it I'm like yep this is mine and I'm kind of sad because they have like a few designs of this kind of dress and I want a ton of them and they only had two I think well, I really want the Elvira dress, and I wanted different colors of this specific dress, but they only had this one, so I was like, okay, it's okay, I buy. I buy anyway. And then we have this dress, which is really hard to show, because it looks kind of weird here. But it looks like this, and I fell in love with this dress, and the material is so nice. It's like super stretchy, and it's super cool, but I just, I didn't really like how it looked on me. I like put it on, I was like, oh, I look kind of stupid, but I'm going to try to make it work somehow. I know I can do this because I love this dress. It's really comfortable and I know I can make it look good. Um, I hope. So yeah, guys, that's all I bought. Um, and now I'm going to show you guys who won the contest. So good luck to everyone. Uh, I also want to show you guys this blanket. I did not buy this blanket. My mom bought it for me while I was at the con. While I was at the con, she went shopping and she got me this blanket. And look at the back. Oh, so soft, but too bad. It's really hot. But yeah, it's so pretty and I, I love it. Now it matches my bed. <laughs> oh, I really like this. Alright guys, I'm going to choose the winner. I wanted to print them out and take them out like that, but my printer broke, so I have all your names, and I put one through whatever it is um, next to it. So it's one through 70, I already counted. So here are you guys, and here's the randomizer, and I put one number from one through 70. So get number, and then I can't see what I'm doing. Okay, <laughs> so get number... Number four. Oh, okay. <laughs> so way up. Number four is Fashionista. What? Eight zero four. Sorry, I can't really see through my camera. So Fashionista eight zero four. You are the winner. So please, um, don't forget to contact me. And um, I'm gonna do my next giveaway pretty soon. Maybe at like a thousand five hundred or something. Or whenever I just feel like it. I just like giving stuff away. <laughs> so yeah. So if you didn't win this time, don't worry guys. <clears throat> I will have another contest and amazing prizes. So thank you guys for entering. And thank you so much for the people who actually made a video. Which was like two people. <laughs> well, but thank you so much. And see you next time. Bye.